Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to another cash stuffing video. So if you're new here, welcome. My name's Alicia. Um, thank you so much for clicking on my video. On this channel, we do all things um, cash stuffing. So we do um, weekly cash stuffings. We do um, savings challenges. We do all the budgeting things. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, definitely stick around. All right, so today we're gonna to be doing our spending money for the week, and then we're also gonna be doing our sinking funds. So we'll go ahead and count our cash first. So, so far we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, and 80. So $280 that we are working with today. And if you made it through all of those ones, um, comment down below with a heart emoji. All right, so we've got lots of 20s and then we've got some ones we're working with. I went through and tried to make change just so I would have plenty of the smaller bills for when I need those. And I also went through and did like a cash condensing because I needed to do that in my binders. All right, so we'll go ahead and get started. And first up, we are going to stuff our spending money for the week. All right, so we'll just trade those out really quickly. All right, so our spending money for the week. All right, so um, these are just our envelopes that we take with us everywhere for our like everyday spending. So first up is groceries. And this month I am trying something new. I am trying to do my grocery shopping for the whole month. So I did that for February and it worked out honestly really, really well. Um, and there was um, only a few times where we felt like, you know, we were running low on a few things. And um, of course we had to go back to the store to buy like, you know, the stuff that that's perishable, like milk and bread and fruits and stuff like that. But as far as like our, um, you know, like our meat and stuff like that, we were able to stay pretty well stocked up. Um, we did kind of run out of snacks earlier than I expected. Um, so we will try to buy more of those kind of things um, for this month, but we're definitely going to try it again and see how that goes. We've got our list all made out already, so we're going to try that for March. All right, so, um, but anyway, what I normally put towards that is $100 each week. So I've just been, I paid for, I've been paying for it with my credit card, and then each week I'll just put the money back towards that. So, all right, next up is our gas envelope, and it gets, it normally gets 60 a week. Um, it's going to get 40 today. Um, my husband went ahead, he had to get gas this morning, so he went ahead and took a 20, so that leaves us 40 for that. Next up is my daughter's piano. She's going to get $20 this week. Okay, and next up is dining out. It's going to get 60, so 20, 40, and 60. And then next up is our spending money for the week. It is going to get 60 also. So 20, 40, and 60. And we use this money if we go over in any of these categories or um, for anything additional that we spend. Like um, a lot of times we'll go to Dollar Tree once a week. We'll, we'll use that money for that. Or if we end up having to go, you know, like to Walmart or just anywhere and we need to spend extra money, that's where that money comes from. Um, it usually does get spent every single week. Our envelopes usually wind up completely empty, um, but it all works out. We try not to go over it, and most of the time, we don't. So, it's good to have that $60 there. It's kind of like a buffer. All right, so that takes care of that. And then next up, we're going to do our personal envelopes for the week. And um, so, each person in my family, we are a family of four. Each person gets $5 just to spend um, however they want to. So there's my car tags envelope. I did take care of that this week, so I need to add that one back in eventually, but I'm gonna take a break from it for the time being. And I did finally get some new stickers for 
our envelopes because um, our old ones were kind of falling off. So I did get some for my husband and myself for our envelope. Um, so anyway, each person's gonna get five dollars. So this is my husband. He's gonna get five. One, two, three, four, and five for him. And this is the first time in a couple of weeks where we haven't pulled out of these envelopes. So hopefully we can stick with that. So he has a total of five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten in his. And then next up is gonna be my envelope, and it is gonna get five dollars also. So one, two, three, four, and five. And I did really good last week. I didn't pull out of mine either. So that puts us up to, should be 10, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 in there. Okay, next up is gonna be my older daughter. She's gonna get five. So let's see, one, two, three, four, and five. So she has a total of, and our kids do much better about not spending their money than we do. So um, my older daughter, she has one, two, three hundred, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, and twenty-two. So three hundred and twenty-two in there so far. So she's doing really good on hers. Um, she always saves her money. She very rarely will spend out of there. All right, and then next up is my younger daughter, so she's gonna get five also. One, two, three, four, and five. And she has a total of, whoops, she's got a little bit of change in hers. We'll add the five in. All right, so she has 100, 200, five, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. So 225 for her. Um, and she is a little bit of a, more of a spender, uh, but she does have some money that um, she has right now. So when we've been spending, she's been spending that. So she hasn't pulled out of here in a good while. So that's good. Just building those up. All right, so that takes care of all of that. So we'll switch over now to our sinking funds. And let's see here. And I do have one of these 20s is for um, my savings challenges. So I'm gonna move this and put it to the side so I don't accidentally stuff it here. All right, so let's see. I've got a list here of everything. Um, all right, so Let's see, I feel like I'm forgetting something, but I guess, I guess we're good. Okay, um, so first up is gonna be our medical envelope. It is gonna get $12 today. So let's see here. So we're gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and 12. So this one has a total of 100, 200, 300, 400. So 400, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and 22. So 422 there. Um, so I'm trying to build this one back up to 500. So we are getting closer. I did have some savings challenge money where I finished some savings challenges and I was able to put quite a bit in there. So been able to kind of build it up a little bit more. All right, next up is going to be our giving envelope. So that is just like extra giving at our church um, above and beyond like our, our regular tithes. Um, so it is going to get $5 today. So let's do one, two, three, four, and five. So it has a total of 120, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, and 45. So 145 in there. So let me know down below if you guys had a good week. Um, we had a much better week this week. Last week was kind of crazy. We had a lot of stuff kind of come up, um, but this week was much better. Um, let's see, everybody's getting better. We were sick the week before. I wasn't sick. Um, one of my daughters was sick and my husband was sick. So. They are better now, so we were able to get out of the house a little bit this week. And then, um, let's see, my younger daughter, she started her softball this week. She started her practices, um, so we got to go do that one night this week. So 
so that was good um she had a really good time she ended up she got um one of her coaches from last year she was like the assistant coach last year so um she's like head coach this year so um, my daughter got on her team and then um, she's got one of her friends on that team um, so she moved up in her age group in softball she was playing at u and she turned nine back at the end of the year and um, so now she's moved up to um, the 10 u age group so it's a whole new thing they're doing like kid pitch this year in the past it was always coach pitch so it's a learning curve um, but that's good for her um let's see some of the kids on her team she is like last year she was one of the like biggest kids on her team um but this year she's just tiny next to some of these girls i mean some of them are are quite a bit bigger so we're excited to see how that goes this year all right so next up is going to be car insurance and it is going to get 25 so we've got 20 one two three four and five and um so you guys will remember before i was putting like 25 each week into our car tags because that was coming due and i needed to build that up so i know that car insurance is going to come due soon so um that's kind of gonna be kind of like my higher priority for a little while so we have a total in here of 150 70 90 95 100 so 200 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so 207 in there so far so that one's doing pretty good okay next up is going to be our land savings and um let's see we used some savings challenge money so um that video was filmed I think on Tuesday so we were able to check off this 15 so now we'll be starting another one on our little tracker so we're gonna do 25 next that'll be the next one that we are working towards um, so it is gonna get 10 today so we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten and then maybe next week we'll be able to check off that 25 if not next week definitely should be able to do it the following week so that one is doing pretty good. I want to say there's like a little over 300 in there. Um, let's see. Let me just count it because I don't remember. It's got one, two, so 250, 300, 5, 10, 15. So 315 and then the 10 from today is 325. So that one is growing decently. Um, that is just money we're saving up to buy land one day. We don't have anything like picked out right now. Um, we haven't found any land that we want to buy just yet. So we're just saving up so that we have the money when we decide to do that. All right, next up is our new car. It is going to get $1 today. Um, so I do put in $100 each month towards this. I just keep it in the bank. So I have this $500 placeholder that's um, the $500 that's in the bank. So we've got 500, 50, 70, 71 towards a new car so far. Okay, and then next up is I decided to add Christmas back in. That is something that we definitely need to start saving up for. Um, so I did finish off the car tags last week. So we added this one back in for now and it is gonna get $7 today. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, and um, I erased all of my stuff. I had this colored in from last year, and I do need to decide what I want these icons to be. Last year I did 25, so I'll probably um, stick with that. So we need 25 to be able to color in one of the little icons. All right, so that takes care of all of our sinking funds and i should have several videos coming out next week um i'm definitely going to be doing my penny savings challenge i missed that the last couple weeks um we were just busy and i didn't get that filmed so i have a lot of change so um definitely tune in for that video it should go up towards the beginning of the week hopefully on monday um i'm also going to be doing um, a debt confession next week um, I'm planning on doing a, like a budget with me. I haven't done one of those in a while, um, but I did have somebody comment and ask me if I could do one of those videos. So I could definitely do that. Um, the only reason I don't do those every single month is because my budget doesn't really change 
Um, so it gets kind of repetitive. So I don't normally film those just because I don't want to put out the same video every single month, you know. So, um, but I'm going to do that for March. And yeah, so lots of things coming up. And that is all I have for you guys today. So thank you so much for tuning in for another video. And if you're new here and you haven't subscribed yet, please consider hitting the subscribe button and helping me grow my channel. I will see you guys back here next time. Bye.